robbery. Champ Sport heading north on Pine. I repeat, he is an armed robber heading north on Pine Street. Okay, we're in route. Steve, the cops! Yo, burn him! Go, 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 go! out the window. Put your other oh. hand up on your back. Get your other hand on your back. To use as a reference point for all of the damage on the car. Uh, specifically, they're looking to track bullets. It's creating a virtual point so that they can use that as a reference for the different damage that's found in the car. Specifically, they're looking for bullet holes. The masking tape that you see on the ground, if you mm -hmm. want to pan down, is to square off the car to help with measuring any evidence, for instance, like the bullet holes or a bullet located in the car. Same thing with this line of tape, is the baseline for measuring. And they're gonna be measuring the, bullet, the position of the bullet holes on the car against those reference points. Also, they're beginning to document the car. In other words, they're beginning to do their, their photography to guarantee or to make sure that the car uh, can be documented in the condition they found it. They're also sketching the car. The one thing that they're going to do that they haven't done yet and they don't know anything about is that they have to get some characteristics of these cars. So they'll also be doing the, the wheelbase of the car as well as the uh, track loop. And that's a measurement they have yet to, to do. They've never learned about that. So this is the beginning stages of processing these cars, and uh, as they move along, they'll be looking to do the bullet pass and determine the position of the shooters. 